Okay, uh, today we're going to uh, unbox the Xbox One. It's our first Xbox One. I know there's, uh, they've been out for quite some time. In fact, they're ready to come out with the Xbox One S, I believe it is. Got this on Prime, uh, Amazon Prime. They had a Prime Day deal. I uh, got this plus a controller and a couple of other things, a free game or something like that. Uh, we've had an Xbox 360 forever, uh, so you know I'm familiar familiar enough with Xbox. I was I'm actually hoping to use the uh, media uh, player in this uh, more extensively and uh, see what that does. We we're basically cord cutters. We don't have cable TV. We only have uh, an antenna. We also have Hulu and Netflix plus Amazon Prime, which I highly recommend for anybody uh, who's a cord cutter. Uh, so let's go ahead and start opening this up. Looks like it slides out on both sides. Not quite. There we go. There we go. Well, let's go ahead and pop this out. Give me a second. There we go. They just love these plastic things, don't they? There we go, finally. Okay. Okay. Let me slide these out. Okay. Got a box. Let's see what's in that box. Oh, yeah, the other uh, game I got was a Forza, uh, yeah, FYI. Okay, so we got here, uh, looks like we've got the Xbox One, Tom Clancy's The Division. Uh, we redeemed the code to download it, I'm assuming. Yeah, one player, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so cheap headphones. Let me see what we got here real quick. Crappy headphones, I'm sure but that's what comes with the unit. We'll go ahead and try those out, see if they work. If not, I'm sure my kids are gonna hate it and want brand new ones, probably like in the 60 to $100 range. We've got a controller plus batteries. Uh, nice, nice controller. We also got a free controller uh, with it. It is the uh, Dusk Shadow, and I'll be doing another Xbox or unboxing of that. Batteries, quick setup guide, game deals. No, no, can't see that. No, 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 no. Okay, so we got game deals uh, for Xbox Live. Geez, did I give anything away on this? Yeah, I might have. So I'm going to do that again and probably so people don't see all these codes. Uh, as well as this one here, Xbox Live. So I think we already have an Xbox Live account, so I don't know if that's going to matter. Xbox One. Give me a quick startup guide. Setup, configuration. It looks real basic. I'm probably going to go ahead and do that uh, while you guys watch. Yeah, it's a plug. Big old brick. Typical of Xbox One. Power cord. You see HDMI, good, all good. All righty. There we go. There's nothing in there. Pull this out. 
go ahead and set this stuff up in a minute. I'll just uh, put, have you go through the setup. Hopefully it'll be fairly quick. Uh, you know, uh, as far as reviews and stuff, I'm sure there's plenty of sites out there that have reviews on the Xbox One versus versus the uh, whatever the other one is out there. The uh, yeah, that one, that other one. Mm -hmm. P P PlayStation, PS4 or PS2, whatever they're on. So let's go ahead and pull this guy out. Kind of heavy. I would think with a power supply brick as heavy as it is, this wouldn't be as heavy. It looks like it's probably upside down based on the pads here. Let's go ahead and pop that open. It's a little boxy, I think. Yeah, I really don't like the design. It reminds me of old style DVD players or VHSs. Uh, so, I don't know. Kind of like this, that's kind of cool. Uh, it does have the uh, uh, CD here. HDMI, Let's see what we got in the back here. We've got uh, power cord, HDMI out to television, sound, HDMI in from satellite or cable. Uh, this will pass through your signal to your television from your uh, cable provider. Uh, two USB ports. It uh, looks like a, oh, this is, looks like it's for the Connect, which I don't have. Uh, IR out and Ethernet and locked. Okay, so there you have it. Uh, let me go ahead and try getting this set up. I'll be back in a minute to get that going. Well, let me just do this real quick while we're here. Go ahead and pop this off. Just that's, comes off nice and easy. Let's see here. Got positive and negative. Pop that guy back on. There it is. You can see it's working. I don't have an Xbox to, Xbox to hook it up to yet, but we'll change that here in a second. I'll be back. Okay, so this uh, plugs into the back here. Let's see right there. We go. And then plug in the power, plug in the HDMI cable. You see we're going out to TV. And we'll go to the input. On the TV. HDMI one. Right there. Okay, HDMI one, we should plug this into it. I think it is wireless, but I have a cord here that I could use. So I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into the internet right directly, which isn't, doesn't wanna reach. So I will make it reach. Okay, that should do. Plug this into the Ethernet cord right there. And let's go ahead and power it on. Okay, as you can see, it's telling me to press the button A. All I did was, uh, when I turned this on, I pressed this, uh, the uh, Xbox button, and it went ahead and uh, paired it up with the uh, unit, with the Xbox One. Uh, so now I'm gonna go ahead and press A. 
Hi, English. Okay, so let's give this a try. The uh, quality of this television isn't the greatest, but to go ahead and select English. Change your display. Let me see if I can do 1080. I'm not sure if this goes 1080, but it does. Really much better. Uh, keep display. And I'm just going through the uh, thumb button. Uh, you're connected, so that's good. Where do I live? United States. Time to update. Press A to start. Oh, wow. So it's got quite an update to do. So I'll come back uh, to this as soon as it's done. See this beautiful television here, the wonderful monitor. Uh, okay. Okay, we're back. Uh, uh, finished uh, downloading and installing and updating and all that good stuff. Now it's telling me to press the Xbox uh, button, which I will do as soon as it becomes alive. So it's connecting to the Xbox One right now. Want to go solid? There we go. Choose your time zone. Uh, Pacific time. Nope. There are two power options for your Xbox while you're not using it. Let's take a look next. Instant on or energy saving. I'm going to go with energy saving. I'm not sure. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to go energy saving, S slower startup time. That's fine. Sign in with your Microsoft account. I just did a password reset because I can totally forgot what it was. I haven't used this in forever. So we're going to go ahead and log in if I can. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this. Uh, so, okay, I'm back. Uh, sign in, security preferences, no barriers on this Xbox. People can sign you in, change your settings, and buy things. We sign in, buy things, or change your settings. Oh. Let me see. I'm going to say no barriers for now. I trust my kids. I know that's not a smart thing. Uh, sign in instantly when you try this Xbox. Yes, because the signing in is a pain. Here's how you look on Xbox. God, I look good, huh? Huh? Jeez. Okay. Choose a color. Let me see. Uh, I don't know. That's good. Go with the blue. Go get more with gold. Play online with friends. I would play online. Up to seven hundred dollars in free games. Get deals. So I think I got a deal here. Okay, so I'm going to go down here. Since I have a code, I'm going to use a code, which is a long ass code. WTF. Oh my God. Or a QR, or scan a QR. Oh man. I don't have anything to scan it with, so I'm screwed. There you go. Okay, I'm going to pause it while I do this because that's going to be take forever. 14 day free trial. I'm going to go ahead and sign up for it because of the kids and what have you. So. Uh, go ahead and close this and take off and see what's going to happen here. Oh, whatever. Next. I suppose this has probably got 
sound that I'm not hearing. I'm not hearing anything. So, looks like we got a problem with the sound. Uh, it could be this TV, um, so I'm just going to ignore that. Uh, but that's, I think, probably going to be it. Go ahead. Oh, here we go. So, I need to figure out, I'll go through and figure out how to download, because I have a download code for Tom Clancy's The Division. Um, I don't think I want to start a party. So I don't even know how to use this thing. Nope, I didn't want to do that. So leave party. Let's turn off. Okay, so let's go store games. Let me see. Use code. Again, I don't have the thing, so let me go ahead and open this up. It's got a code in it. Go ahead and use the code. Uh, pause it again. Okay, so I entered the code, and I'm going to confirm by hitting the A button. And that's it. Unbeast, you now own. So I'm assuming it's going to download it in the background. Okay, that's it. Uh, thanks for watching. If there's any questions, comments, uh, you need to know anything, any constructive criticism, uh, by all means, go ahead and leave me a comment below. If you've enjoyed this, go ahead and like it, and thanks for watching.